All right, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up some arm swinging locomotion uh, to uh, move your player in your VR game uh, in Unity. So this will be using the Unity uh, VR template, which I've never used before, but it seems to uh, include a lot of the things to get you going in your VR build. And uh, yeah, we're going to use an arm swinging a, um, script, uh, plug some of the uh, built-in components in your VR template, and yeah, get you moving. So we'll get to it. All right, so uh, first thing is how I built this project. So I did new project. Uh, I built it uh, with the editor 2021.3.7, and I actually used this template right here. So this VR core uh, template. Uh, I've never used it before, uh, but I wanted to see what it was about, and this seemed like a good sample project to do that. So I created the project and it came uh, out looking like this. After it loaded and everything, it had an XR rig, uh, the controllers, a plane, so you can see movement and kind of test things out, and a controller setup. Uh, and the controllers are um, already, like it already has rigged controllers uh, that you can see. So yeah, if you take this and just launch it into your, uh, your Oculus, uh, it works. Oh, let me build settings. So uh, first, I think it starts off uh, using the Windows platform. So you do need to switch it if you're building for an Oculus, uh, which is what this tutorial um, is for, an Oculus Quest. I'm using an Oculus uh, Quest 1 or an Oculus Meta, Meta whatever they're calling it now. <laughs> I, I can't keep up. Uh, but yeah, so you switch to Android uh, and you've got to make sure that you have the Oculus um, included in the XR plugin management. So that's if you go to your, um, I did that a little quick, so I'll go a little bit slower. So if you go to your file and build settings, and then you want to go to player settings. And then uh, you click on the XR plugin management, which actually this template includes, uh, all right out the box so that's really nice uh, but I don't there's nothing checked so you want to make sure that you include the oculus uh, that's you know check that for the Android and then I just left the default settings under the oculus settings so once you do that what you do need to do to get the arm swinging locomotion working is um, add this script the swinging arm motion to your um, XR rig. We can see here, uh, you can look at the script too and go through it. How this script works is it takes a frame and then it looks at the previous frame and looks at the location of the controllers in the scene. And depending on the difference in those positions, it propels your player forward. Uh, so that's what we're doing here. Uh, you can look through this script, um, tweak things if you want, uh, and what we're going to do is uh, add some of the game objects that are required. So the first two are the left hand and right hand. That's pretty obvious, the left controller and right controller here. The main camera, which is under the camera offset, is the main camera. We'll add that to the main camera. And the next thing is the forward direction. So for that, we actually need to create another object under the camera offset, we can just create an empty and call it forward direction. And what we want to do is just move it, make sure it's always in front of the player. So we can actually just set the Z to one, just so that it's always right in front of where the player camera is. And that's just lets us know that that's always in the forward direction. If we go back to the XR rig and we add the forward direction, and actually, before we build it to our Oculus, we can actually test it here in the editor. So we're gonna lock this uh, XR rig just so we can view it in the inspector. And we're gonna press play. And then we're going to, once it plays, select the right camera or right controller. You can see it there. What we're actually gonna do just in what it's playing in the play mode, move it up and down. 
And so you can see here in the uh, game view, the player is actually moving. And if you move it quickly, you move faster. So yeah, that should work. I'm going to load it in the Oculus and I'll upload that video here. Okay, so that seemed to work well. Um, yeah, so that's how you can propel your player forward with arm locomotion. Uh, thanks so much for watching.